Welcome back to Pathologic 2. Last episode, we... Oh, sorry, I just realized something. Um, last episode, we spoke with Aglaia here at the cathedral. Now it's time to go speak with Var about the serum that Ruben apparently created to see if Var can tell me more about what's in it. I assume I'm supposed to basically have it on me, but I guess it's not a physical object that I have in my inventory. I guess I just have it. I think. Also, apparently I forgot to put back a mysterious note that I got from one of the caches. So, whoops. Hopefully it doesn't matter which cache it goes into and I can just put it back in a cache somewhere. <laughs> um, the thing I just realized is that I'm extremely close to death and I thought that was because of the infection and I'm sure that's part of it, but actually I just realized my hunger's maxed out. So that probably is making an even bigger difference. Hunger hurts you really fast. So I desperately, very, very quickly need food and a healing item. I don't have any even nuts on me, so I can't even do that. However, I do have to go to Vars. It's pretty close. And there's a chemist there. The really, really, really creepy chemist. So hopefully they'll sell like a bandage. It's a grocery store up there. I'm not sure what's more important, honestly. The grocery store to get some food or just a bandage? Probably the grocery store because hunger hurts you very fast. Anyway, let's go. We have no time to waste. I would not be surprised if I die before I get there, actually. It's going the right way. Yes. Go, go, go. I should try to trade with somebody, too. Yeah, they have toast. Oh, I can't get it, though. They won't even give me a bad trade. I wish I could get a bad trade for tanking my reputation, but nope. Oh, peanuts. Yes, for peanuts for a chisel, I can eat that. It will provide me extremely little sustenance, but I just need to survive literally seconds more. That hurt was from the infection, I think. If I can deal with the hunger, we'll see if I die from the infection on the way to Vars. Talk. Hardhead. Put your purse away, Ripper. We don't trade for money anymore. What's that supposed to mean? Drag your ears out of your pockets, will you? Coupons. All food is only sold for coupons now. Inquisitorial decree to crucify profiteers. Are you kidding? Where do I get them? Go to the town hall and ask yourself. I suppose they'll add coupons to the fund rewards. You doctors are the upper crust now, after all. I'd like to eat before I get the fund reward. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Ah. <sighs> Hop on over to the town hall. Easy. Hmm. <laughs> I just took another tick of damage from hunger, I think. I I'm gonna load my game. Shit. This is really bad. <laughs> this is really, really bad. Alright, running over to Vars. I'm gonna bandage away the hunger pains, I guess. I don't think... I don't think I'm gonna fucking get there. Oh, that's not useful. Put that away. Put that away. Coffee, 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 coffee. That's not gonna help. Kashik, that will help. Yes, 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 yes. Two fingernails for a Kashik. 
Okay, that is enough to buy me some time. My health is still like two or something, just absurdly low. And I just took damage from the infection, but it's not that much damage. Nonetheless, I've still come to a dead end part that doesn't actually lead to Vars. Hmm. It's fine. It's fine. I've really dug myself a hole, haven't I? Took more damage. Oof. Come on. Creepy chemist, please have some bandages. Please don't tell me you want coupons for them. You're a creepy chemist. Come on. Where's the... Fuck, where's the creepy chemist? Trade. I can trade with you? Yes. And you... Do it for money? Yes, you still do it for money. I will take all your tourniquets and all of your bandages. Okay, I have a little bit of breathing room. Actually, a decent amount of breathing room. Oh, thank fucking God. That was stressful. So you say you know how to connect things, which is why you cut, rip, and break them, just like your father. Reuben made a cure for the sand pest, and he made it from strange blood. And you know a lot about blood. Reuben? Who's Reuben? My father's apprentice. Didn't he come to you? Lots of idiots found their way into Isidore's circle. Though I guess not all of them were completely stupid. So we made a cure, huh? For uh, you sure? From blood? So its price will rise. No, that was special blood. Human won't do. A cure, huh? You're a big talker. What does a smart ass like you want from me? Advice? Here. If you tell on me to that unholy wench, I'll claw my way out of hell to drag you back down with me. Got it? I'm not planning on telling her shit. I won't tell on you. And in return, you'll tell me where to find the most unusual blood in this town. Herb brides dance with the earth at the ear. Did you know? To make Twire bloom better cover themselves in some sort of mud that they call blood. You can probably pick its sample there if you want. I bet you haven't tried to brew a cure from mud, huh? <laughs> mm. I call the mud blood, but this is making me think that this is where I'm going to have to kill Nara. This is what they meant, you will have to kill me because I'll need their blood. This might be it. You know what? I'll pay them a visit. Don't suppose I'll ever find out what Reuben made his cure from, but strange blood seeps from the ground by the ear. Shehen. The ear is in Shehen. Where's that? <gasps> Finally! For the first time, I have a quest that takes me out here. I wanted to go out there, and I was halfway there. A long, long, long time ago. Maybe even in the first playthrough, I'm not sure. But then I had a quest pop up that made me come back. That opportunity could disappear at midnight, so I might only have a couple hours to do that. Maybe... Okay, yeah, I think I got a plan. Kinda. I don't have much else to do, really. Other than go talk with Saba about Reuben. That's very important. And of course, go here. I want to do that all before midnight. Everybody's been treated, right? Yeah. 
Yeah, everybody's been treated. Even Saba? Yes. So let's take a boat over here. Probably to this one, go to Saba's place, and then down here. Hold on, where does my stats fit into that, though? Decent amount of health, high hunger, I need food. But, like, I don't have any coupons. I'm not going to be able to buy it at any grocery store. I guess I could go to the shady shop. That's where food is still sold for money. Yeah, I guess so. Alright, let's go. Gotta go up across the bridge and around. Yeah, my infection's kind of high. Let's take a plus antibiotic. This is going to hurt. Oof. But it lowered my infection significantly. I think that's the right call. As bad as it feels, I think it's the right call in the long term. I hope. If I supposedly have this cure on me, I'd love to just drink it right about now. I mean, that would be such a waste if I just drank it before I studied it, but, you know, I could use it. I don't end up dead because 35 minutes are going to pass and my hunger's high. Is it going to be maxed out and I'm dying? No. No, no, no. I'm fine. Good. Can I get food here? I don't have food stored away. I, uh, shady shop. Yeah. I think I already bought some food from the shady shop as a thing, so I don't know if I can buy more. I imagine I probably didn't buy all their food. I see a purse walking in. Why are you here to bust me? Don't you try anything funny. I'm the only one left selling food for coin now. You won't find a second merchant like me in the whole town. Hmm? What do you mean? <laughs> Clueless sod. The big city wench forbade coin. Now it's all about those coupons. Try to survive just eating whatever you can trade for her candy wrappers. Oh, and share it all with everyone else. A dictator she is. But you're still selling food against her law? Bold. Think you'll keep this business running long? Long enough if you turn your pockets out. It's not like the candy wrapper lady is here forever. It'll all calm down in a week or sooner if someone puts her in a box. I'll have a whole vault of wealth by then. So, what'll it be? Docking or trading? You're a sly one. Show me your goods. Oh yeah, they have plenty of food. I, however, don't have plenty of money. Let's go with milk. Okay, now I have a serious amount of breathing room. How 
How much time do I have? Ooh, not much. I can maybe get to Saba's place in time before midnight, but not to here. I can't imagine that this would disappear at midnight though, right? Blood seeping out of the ground? I doubt that would just stop. You never know. Am I gonna make it there before midnight? Uh, yeah, I should make it to Saba's place. Fucking hell, though, my immunity. I don't have any tinctures, do I? Oh, I got a Yas one. That will increase my... Hunger? Yeah, that'll increase my hunger. I don't want to take that. I want to get to Saba's. That's very important to me. I don't want to misc... Misc. I don't want to miss the opportunity to talk about what the hell happened with Reuben. Almost there. Almost there. Ooh, that's a good sound. Ash and Swish, maybe? Can't really stop to get it, though. 20 minutes? Yeah, we'll definitely get to Sabas. And death rolls all its die at midnight. Connections. Mend everything your father has torn, even if he was right to tear it. You come with a heavy heart to Seger. Yeah, let's get to the point. Did your people kill Reuben? His conscience killed him. He, too, walked around with a heavy heart, so it tore away and slipped from his chest. Hmm. Why did he feel so guilty? He killed a man. We became the suspects. He knew, but did not come clean. Wanted to stall for time. Did his work while we were being killed for his sin. His conscience finished him off. A decent enough man. Whom did he kill? A big man. A strong man. A man who carried a whole world within him. A man who carried our town. Why? Do you need a name? Have you not enough worries as it is? You cannot avenge your father, so you grasp at opportunities to avenge a friend, too. A man who carried a whole world within him? Are we talking about the Udurg? What have you done to Reuben? Speak, Ekene. You know. Our hands never touched him, but eyes can touch. So we looked at him, made him look at us, made his conscience eat him from the inside. Were you the one who organized this? Or were your elders? What does it have to do with me? We, Katange, feel everything together. We hold no counsel, we give no orders. The elders listen, the kin acts. Stehen wakes up again. Have you heard of the old village? I have. Was Reuben's fate decided there? Everything is decided there. The soil there is thin, so one can hear everything. Understand, Aseger, that only in your world do people decide who lives and who dies. Think so highly of themselves. We do not think, we listen. Everything happens on its own. If that was true, you'd be still walking on all fours. Consider a flock of birds. Birds give no advice, no speeches. They take wing all at once and go where they need, for they know how to listen. They know not the concept of self. They fear death not. You'll become like that too. All who come to Stehen understand. I won't. I'm different. I don't like this. I tried to help Reuben, but it wasn't enough. Who killed him? 
The kin who spilled no blood? His conscience which could never find peace? The friend who failed in his task? My task? It doesn't matter, I suppose. In the end, Sta is dead. I still need to go over there. There is basically no time that I'll... No time for me to get there before midnight. Should I go right now? Yeah. There's like the tiniest chance that I might make it before midnight. There's no way. There's absolutely no way, really. Did the voice have subtitles before? There was a patch for the game, just right before I played. I wonder if that changed. Six minutes? There's literally no chance. I really, really, really hope that doesn't disappear. Please. And death? You better roll low, you asshole. I'm nervous. Is this gonna be the day that somebody finally dies? From the plague, that is? Time moves faster, yet there are fewer discontinuities. You'll have a chance to finish important business at night, or tomorrow. A reward awaits you in the fund. If you don't claim it before tomorrow evening, it will be distributed among the poor. A thousand people have died. Alright, where are we at? Good, not infected. Bad grief. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was close. Oh no. I didn't even know that they were in danger. Shit, I guess I didn't go up there to see. Well, Lara's infected now, but Notkin isn't. Good. Sticky, come on, buddy. Yeah. Anna, whatever happens to you happens. Lucky again. Katarina, my- oof! Oh, that was close. My treatment failed for them. Peter? Huh. Whew. Andre? Fuck! Two new infections, that's- mm, that's bad. That's four infected. No, five infected. That's a lot of people to treat. The day is over. The end draws ever closer. A new pantomime is rehearsed at the theater. Fun has a reward for me. Oh, is the quest still there? It is, thank God. And after dark, the people come to Saba's place. That's a thing now. The kids gather at the evening, that's a thing. Oh, I really should do the dead item store, because I have a lot of dead items. As long as that fucker doesn't go back to taking coupons too, or tickets or candy wrappers or whatever. <laughs> Are these leading the path? Uh, yeah, these like lead on the path to the village. You know what these look like from above? They look like staples. Sealing a wound shut. Like this has been a cut. I'm not gonna go out of my way for an herb that isn't something rare. drink some water. Those bulls heads up there? I think so. Stehen, a place of old. Hello? Hello? You look 
Violent. You look like you're ready to kill me. Now, we come to the time when deities begin to die. This is Foreman Oyun. Remember, I was told about them by young Vlad. I wanted to speak with them, but I couldn't. The step is beautiful in fall, and fall is the season of truth. In fall, we keep our promises, own our deeds, our crimes, cleanse our mistakes. A good season. I know who you are. You're the foreman of the abattoir. I am a broken man. That's who I am. And you are not, kindred. But tomorrow you will be, too. And then nothing will ever be fixed. Tomorrow I'll break? Why the hell would I? Because you are Isidore's son. His charge now rests on your shoulders. And you, you're so little. Mother Bodo, help us all. Do you know what an Uderg is? A terrible tragedy. Many dead. I've seen this disease before. Your father did everything right. I'd give my honor and my life not to let it happen again. But since it has already come to pass, let us take advantage of this tragedy. That's not an answer to my question. Also, take advantage? What are you talking about, Tangare? Our people withered by the year so that the town grew. It was built on our bones. Now, the other way around. The town withers, our people endure. Time to revive the kin. Behara, what we need now is unity, not discord. Wait, kindred. Look carefully. Not at me, at Earth. The lines have brought us both to this dead place. I do not like it. So before you ask anything, tell me. Why have you come? I'm making a cure for the sand pest. I need blood. Unusual blood. Blood medicine, you say? Good. Well, I'm the foreman of the abattoir. My life is blood. I've cut open more bowls than you could ever see in your life. My arms are elbow deep in blood. My legs knee deep. Is this the Uderg's blood? What is it, anyway? This is... difficult to explain. Instead, you should see. You'll need to come with me. To the abattoir. Then let's go. You're the foreman of the abattoir. Who's gonna stop you? It's not that simple. I'll gather the people, open the entrance, but it takes time. We'll figure out how the blood streams from there. Who could have thought? The ear bleeds, Stehen bleeds. This is odd. Was there much blood here? I need to understand what sort of blood it is. Can you tell me? Let me think. You look... bad. Could you possibly be infected too? New person? Foreman Oyun. The blood is in the abattoir. Foreman Oyun will let me in, but it'll take time. I'll have to wait. Okay. She is a herald of the law. Now, we come to the time when deities begin to die. What do you want, Kindred? Tell me, what drives you on this earth? Oh man, these are a lot of options. Hmm. I trust you somehow, and I desperately need advice. Father left me a debt, an obligation. A list of people in danger. There were a bunch of kids, and one Uderg. Do you know what it means? I am no one. The kin's fingernail, a fleck of their skin, what can I do? Your questions, your words, must be addressed to the kin. But one must learn to talk to them, and you don't have the skill. How does one talk to the kin? 
Even father couldn't. The kin are a beast of one heart and many heads, and that beast does not yet acknowledge your mastery. No one would take your questions seriously yet. Saba would? No, you're an outsider to them. Maybe Tai Cheek would take you seriously, but I doubt even that. And the people, to them, you're no one, Keala. I'll talk to Tai Cheek then. Tai Cheek knows not the lines. He struggles to choose one way or the other. Your father had skill. He knew the lines far better than me. And so do you. Your heart chooses right. Tai Chik would acknowledge you, would speak to you on behalf of all Katange. I would support you and explain everything to him, but they would not let me inside the termitary. Who? They shot me with a rifle. The bullet lodged itself beneath the ribs. Nothing I can do now. Since when do we use weapons? What madmen grab knives? How do they intend to live here after that? I don't understand. What can I do? I can overpower six people with my hands alone, but I can't shoot. Let me see your wound. I'm a surgeon. I don't, then. I'm a Yargachin myself. I'll survive. Do what must be done, and do it fast. What must be done? Try to get inside the termitary. You'll find a way. Seek out Overseer Tai Cheek. We need to wield power over the kin to find an agreement. Several thousand people are in the termitary. Olgimsky's town, the town of humans, is dead. We will enter the warren. Then we will again emerge and take what is ours. Do you understand? Aspidi, Saba, she wanted the same. There are so few of us left, Artemy, son of Isidore. Do you understand that only a few hundred people in the world know our tongue? That only a few dozen remember our stories? That less than a dozen can interpret them? Taya is there, a girl from Father's List. That's why I'll go. If the people do not accept you, it's useless. How can you understand us? How can you learn our lifeblood? The knowledge of Earth, of the Uderg, is meaningless when you're alone. When you're confused, unable to share responsibility. We are all responsible. Merge with the kin. Merge with Earth. Then we'll speak, kindred. I want, like, I want to save the kin. I think I want to save the kin. I think I want them to take back the town. I think, I'm not sure. But like a whole culture is dying out. I want to preserve it. Hmm. I understand, kindred. I'll find father's murderer, and we'll seek vengeance together. Father is dead. Oyen doesn't desire power. The kin have two leaders, Overseer Tai Cheek and Saba. All questions seem to lead to the kin. Father's murderer, his debt, the damned Uder, Tai Cheek, the kin's voice, will explain. But he's in the termitary. I'll have to fight my way in. <laughs> I am not in a fighting, like, condition right now. I'll die from one bullet. I have no heart. Do not look at this wound, kindred. Go and do the deed. Why, why are you so insistent that I don't look at your fucking wound? Do you have a home? I am no human, but a bull. Alongo is my home, so while the fort is closed, I will remain here. You know what? Go to Father's house. 
It's vacant. No one will bother you. You can rest there. You're offering me your own house? It's not really mine. Father's house. You two were friends. He'd do that for you, too. Truly, you sense the lines, Katonga. I suppose I should come there once again to remember and to endure the pain. Yeah, just, um, maybe don't go upstairs. Settled, then. Bearla, Tangare. Still, tell me, you looked for mythical bulls among the steppe. The Aroks. Is it true they're extinct? I was looking for ancient bulls. Odong said they'd heard them below, a bellow far away. They were mistaken. I walked the steppe a long time. There are no more ancient bulls. The town devoured them, as it devours us, the kin, Katange. Don't let this loss be for nothing. Go to the Warrens. Hopefully they'll come back with good news. They look so interesting. Really look like they wanted to beat me up, but nope. Thankfully. Should I explore this place at all? I don't want to spend too much time here because I have a lot of things to do. But if there's something I could get here that would help me, that would be awfully nice. Do I have matches? I don't have any matches, which means I can't light my lantern. <laughs> well, that's great. Let me just take a quick look around and see if there's like any... Any things that I can open at all. Well, there's probably good water. It's probably empty, isn't it? No. Yeah, good water. something in one of these tents, right? It's been abandoned for so long, though. I think I'm wasting my time here. I'll just check this last one. I wonder if I would find anything if I just walked out off the map. Dog? Alright. Alright, let's go. What about this one? Okay, last one. There's nothing in there. There's nothing at all. I wish there was a boat out here that I could take back to town. track of my hunger, I just realized it's about to start killing me again. I guess I'll just get to Sapa's place and hope somebody's got food for me. Pretty unlikely, they almost never do. I do appreciate that this isn't the sort of game where, you know, it's not like I'm doing a bunch of mini quests where it feels like everything has to have a reward like it is in a lot of games. Where you do anything and you get some sort of a reward. It's like, oh, I do a mini quest. Like, I'll probably get some money or something for this. 
But no. In Pathologic 2, you very rarely get any sort of monetary reward. It's just about, you know, you're rewarded by doing what you... Oh, I just took damage. By, you know, influencing events in a way that you wanted to do or saving somebody. But it's not money, and I appreciate that. But also, I'm dying. So money and food would be nice. Mostly food, because I can't really spend the money anywhere, can I? Hmm. I think two more hunger ticks and I'm dead. Saba, can I loot your house, please? Actually, fuck. I should just enter a random house and just loot it, shouldn't I? I'm that desperate. Yes, 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 I'm that desperate. I need to do it now. Where is a f fucking door? Wait, I can just enter this? Does that mean it's gonna be full of looters? Is this one of those looter houses? Oh, I think it is. Fuck. Fuck, I need food. Food, food. Food, 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 that's not food. That's... Mm, fuck. Come over here. No! Congratulations, I lived by going outside. Except I'm about to die in literally seconds. Fuck. I have nothing to eat. Are there calories and antibiotics? Does anybody know? Does Twyrein feed me? No. No, that definitely didn't feed me. My health. I literally cannot see my health. <laughs> I think I need to load my save game. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to redo that walk out there. Shit. Alright, I have to load. I have to. I found this very, very sickly looking person right after I loaded my save game that will sell me pemmican for a painkiller. That should definitely be enough. I just had a horrible thought. Oh shit. My immunity is completely out. Is this before I took the Neomycinum Plus? Or after? Uh. I. Mm, I don't know. Anyway, uh, my horrible thought is, when death rolls its die, is it predetermined, like, by a seed, or is it literally random each time it rolls? Meaning, now that it's gonna roll again in a second, could things be different? I'm... scared. I mean, this might end up better for me. Or worse. Or I kind of hope the same. I don't know, I'm nervous. Alright. Alright. I don't remember the exact, like, percentages or whatever it looked like it was at before, so I don't know if these are the same. But, alright, that's good. Yeah. Lara became infected. Still infected. This might be the same results. Nakin should be not infected. I think that's different. I don't think it was that low before. Sticky? Oh, thank god. Anna? You gonna live again? Oh, you are so lucky. Peter? Peter, Peter, Peter? Oh my god, that hurt. That hurt to experience. That also happened before, right? 
I think that was all the same results. Twelve days. Okay. Made it back to Saba's place. Hunger isn't even showing up when I'm out of this menu. That's pretty low. Doing relatively good. Let's see what step people have gathered here tonight. We want to ask our mother. How can we deny ourselves? My body won't let me forget it. I can't stop loving myself while I still have a body. You can try to deny yourself if you want, but why stop loving yourself? I don't know, but I can tell that it's a hindrance. I want to ask Saba of this. Let her teach me. You don't truly love yourself, I can tell. Learn that first. Love is harder than denial. I want to abandon my name. So does my family. The Etseg A, the Abge, the Basagan, the Akshan. Why would we need names? We're no one. How will you refer to each other then? We do not need names to call on each other. We do not need words. I want to ask our mother if we'd lose anything vital by shedding names. No, a name is just a shell. Peel it off. I want to ask our mother about our speech. This foreign tongue impedes us. It slows our minds. How can we refuse it? Speak the step tongue. Telege Yakov Naize. Tegdeg Bagsha, but it's too bare. Too many new things in life that have no names in the step tongue. Invent new words. This is how you can serve our people. Okay, looks like that's it. It was good to speak with him. I was hoping for food, though. <laughs> of course. And bandages. Jesus Christ, bandages, please. I... should go back to home base and do some brewing. What time is it? 1 a.m. We got a bit of time. I mean, there's definitely stuff to do, but yeah, but back to home base, do some brewing. I can do that all fairly fast. Um, gather all my dead items for the dead item shop. Yeah, yeah. 